Well, so now let's add to that, okay? Because I think another important thing that a lot of people don't realize when they're applying to sponsorships is there has to be some sort of a track record. And I think with someone like All Day Anthony, there was a exactly. track record before we even decided to sign on, right? Exactly. Is that exactly. cuz I wasn't here when we when we, you know, started. Yeah, yeah. Initially started, right? So yeah. And that's the thing like he has a, you know, he has a great YouTube following. He does his thing. He he like I said, he didn't need us, but together we do better. You know, and you know, at the, and that's the one thing that you have to kind of take into consideration when you're applying for a sponsorship. Like, what exactly do you have to offer? You know, vice versa. Both of us, both of us together. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, it's the same thing with uh, this car right here, the 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 Miata right here, that Gingium. He's one of the people that we work with. It's the same concept. The gen the the generalization that he doesn't need us, we don't need him. But at the end of the day, together we can accomplish something. And when when you want to apply for sponsorship, it's not saying that you aren't doing great things. It's that at the end of the day, can we work together properly? Mm -hmm. Do, does it make sense us working together? And to add to that, it's also this idea of, you know, like just because you say you're going to do X, Y, and Z, but you don't have X, Y, and Z done, mm -hmm. that's unfortunately not really a basis for us to you know decide if we want to sponsor you y yeah you know what i'm saying someone like Jinjim, for example i imagine when we started working with him maybe had i don't know fifty thousand youtube subscribers or again i wasn't here for that but like i guess what i'm trying to say is to 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 fill out one of our sponsorship proposal forms and say, well, you know, I'm, I, I plan on attending this car show and I'm going to put air ride in the car and I'm going to do this. And I'm going to, we, we believe you. We, we get yeah, that. And, we're, and, and, and we're fans that you're doing it. But, you know, things change. Life happens. You know, there are delays, obviously, now, as I'm sure you're well aware, there are port congestion issues and supply issues. So, like, it's difficult for us to, you know, base our decision on you know what ifs and and, and that's exact that's a exactly a perfect example it's also difficult from our end you have to understand like you know and 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 i've seen this in the past with people that we've worked with it's like you know we we have full confidence in them we go full throttle with them we sponsor them whatever a year later they're gone you it know happens and it happens it's not it's not it's not their fault at the end of the day maybe things happen in life you know, certain things uh, go a, a specific direction, and unfortunately, it didn't work out. That doesn't mean we're not fans, but that's the reason why we got to be selective in certain in certain circumstances. Because, you know, we got to look at it and we got to see the passion, and mm -hmm. that's the thing with me. If you can read through the through what is it, read through the lines when it comes to certain oh the fine print. Yeah, like you could you, you could see that when someone is passionate about something, when someone puts effort into the proposal, when someone is consistently showing us that they they love what they're doing and they want to work with us because they have a passion for it, mm -hmm. you could see it. It's a, this, a perfect example right there. Like, um, thanks, Max, for putting up the Rub Doctor. That's a perfect example. That of, name gets me every I time. I know, right? But <clears throat> pause, you know.